Now, what started as a way to help cancer patients is now helping others impacted by the coronavirus. News 10's Jordan Kudis joins us live this morning from our newsroom to explain what this is and how it's helping people all over the world. Well, John, when Jess started Headbands of Hope, it was made for cancer patients. But what she realized was the material that she used for her headbands, she could actually turn it into something much bigger than just an accessory. Now, here's the story. The project actually kicked off in 2012, and here's how it works. If you buy a headband, a headband is then donated to cancer patients. What you're seeing on your screen is just an example of some of those headbands. Now, Jess turned the materials for those headbands into masks and now they're being donated to healthcare workers. About 50,000 of those masks have been donated so far and now if you buy a headband, a mask will be donated to those fighting on the front lines. You can see a few people on your screen right there who have received those masks. Now the change in mission wasn't hard for Jess and her team if it meant more by helping more people. So we had this like quick moment of like reevaluating and instead of thinking about like how can we keep our business afloat and survive, we thought about what are we doing now that the world needs. Now coming up in the next 30 minutes, I'll explain even further why this entrepreneur took a different turn for the best and also how you can get involved at home. But for now, reporting live from our newsroom, Jordan Kudish, News 10.